myself, James Benzie, aka the Bearded Benzie. So, the other day we did the one kit. Today I'm doing the Inacurn EQ pod system. So, I'm gonna flip over as we always do in a non professional fashion, unlike some other professional reviewers, because I don't do it like that just because I'm different. You just get it as it is, and if I like it, it gets put up. If I don't, it doesn't, and we'll just film it again. Or if Chris presses the wrong button and deletes it, then we have to do it again, and I'll tell you that we've done it again. Like the last two videos, I think I need a new camera assistant, so Chris, be careful, you're gonna end up getting satellite. So, I'm gonna pop over, we'll do a close up, and then we'll pop back, guys. And we're back, guys, with the EQ pod system from Inakin. So, let's slide it open. One thing I do like doing with these is I like looking on the back because a lot of them don't tell you what coil it actually comes with. This comes with a 0.5 of an open coil, but it doesn't tell you whether it's a C-cell, whether it's organic, it doesn't tell you anything. It just tells you it's a refillable pod. The one thing about this that I do like is the size of the battery, which is 800 milliamp hours for a little pod system. Now, there she is. Look at that. Nice little touch on there, and it does have a really nice rubbery feel to it. So there you go, the pod just comes out. And you want a nice little light system on there as well. Standard, three clicks on, three clicks off. The one thing I did enjoy about this is the way that this mouthpiece of the pod is actually shaped to your lips. It actually fits really, really nice. And um, the other trick part of this pod, I know a lot of pods are filled on the side or from other means. This has a cool little twist feature. So you just twist the whole base and you can fill either side. So I really enjoyed that one. Again, I'm simple, but I like that. So I've coupled this with salt fizz. So we'll pop back over in a sec and we'll see what that's like with those. So let's just see what's in this side because this one actually come with some paperwork unlike the iJoy one did the other day. So. USB, standard in every kit. I don't know why people keep on going on about it. And then we get the little Easy Q instruction book so you can see how, look at this. Some little details there. It tells you how to fill everything. Pretty much what I'm telling you now. Oh, I see. I like it when you find stuff you don't know what it is. So you have a warranty and safety card, a warranty card, and a battery care guide. This is nice to see, guys. A lot of companies now are sending these out and telling you how to care for your batteries properly. So there is this myth that vaping is bad because batteries explode. It's not, it's just because people don't look after their batteries and just slam it on charge over overnight and do whatever the hell they want to do with it. So we're going to disappear guys and then I'll be back with you. Welcome back guys. So as you know we're doing the Inicurrent EQ pot system. So like I was saying a moment ago I have coupled this with the Salt Fizz menthol. Um, just because I like testing these pod systems with these. So unlike most other pod systems, it doesn't have an automatic drawer on it, so you can't just pick it up and draw. And now Chris is making banging noises, and I'm going to batter it, I swear to God. So we should wait until this is filmed. Um, yeah, like I was saying, this has a button, so you have to vape with the button. So I am, in the future, doing the SMPOOS pod system kit, uh, which is new to the Electrofrag family. We'll talk about that one a little bit differently. But for this one, so your charge report is on the bottom there with all your details and telling you it's an 800 milliamp hour battery, which is, as far as I know, one of the biggest pod system batteries, uh, especially for something this size as well. So let's just have a look at the way it works. So as with all pod systems, the pod just clips in and it's magnetically held in there. But again, this one, when you refill, just a twist and I do really like this and now this just goes round and round and round and round you can just keep on spinning it just revolves and revolves and revolves so this is actually my first try I mean I filmed this up before filming just so I didn't have to wait and do it during filming uh, but I want to see what this actually vapes like carries itself really really well um, I'm not overly impressed with the vapor production for a pod system. Um, there are better pod systems out there, but that delivers that nicotine exactly how you want it to. If I'm gonna be completely honest with me being completely honest, I have had better pod systems than this. Um, it feels a bit square. I 
don't like the fact that it doesn't have the automatic draw on it, that's a little bit of a letdown because that's key to most pod systems is that automatic draw and it makes it just nice and easy and simple for when you're carrying one about. Uh, the one that we just spoke about I do carry around all the time. Unfortunately I won't be carrying this one around just for that reason. I don't want to be getting out of my pocket, turning it on, and then having to press the button, turning it off. I'd rather just get it out of my pocket, pull, put it back in my pocket. So that's the only letdown to me. The pod system design is amazing. I absolutely love the idea of it. And I know that this is built to last, and this is probably going to outlast a lot of pod system kits because it's made by Inkin. I think Inkin could have done a little bit better with their design on it, if I'm being completely honest. But again, that's just personal preference. Some of you may love it, some of you may hate it. But I don't know. And I just got a little bit of spit back there as well, which I haven't had off a pod system before. Uh, so, yeah, there's a couple of things to keep your eye out on this one. I mean, again, I'm not a massive lover of this kit. That's personal preference though guys, but if you do want a pod system, we do have a large variety, both in store at any electro fag, so that's here in Ellesmere Port, the Wigan store, the Liscard store and the Liverpool store, also on the electro fag website. So guys, vape on, vape strong, and as always, keep it cloudy.